the name, the intellectual capacity, the fact that majority of this, mm. of, 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 of those of you, you have great experience and you want Nigeria to prosper. First and foremost, to provide impetus to enable Nigeria to finally take advantage of livestock farming, dairy product, cold chain logistics, collectively offer substantial commercial and economic advantages. We have seen solution and opportunity. With this adversity that uh, had plagued us over the years, and I believe the prosperity is here in your hands. The dairy industry contributes significantly to nutrition and food security by supplying essential proteins and vitamins through milk and its derivatives such as cheese, yogurt, butter, and economic advantages. Efficient cold chain logistics are crucial in maintaining the quality and safety of these perishable goods from farm to market, thereby reducing food waste and ensuring a steady supply. This sector will boost agricultural productivity, enhance export opportunities, and stimulate economic growth by fostering a robust value chain that benefits farmers, processors, herders, distributors, and consumers alike. Let me take advantage of the presence there. Thank the former executive governor of Kano State, and the chairman of all progressive party, Abdullah Ganduje, for assembling the best minds and experts to find solutions, convening the National Conference on Livestock Reforms and Mitigation of Associated Conflicts in Nigeria in February last year. The far-reaching recommendations in their report informed our decision to constitute and inaugurate this presidential committee on the implementation of livestock reforms and seize a great opportunity to better the lives of our people rather than the conflict promoted agenda. It is our renewed hope and I believe that hope is here. <laughs> Try to see a great opportunity for wealth. In a situation that is very confusing, I must mention here that I've discussed a number of occasions with the governors. They need to see this opportunity. Seize it. They run with it. From here, are we at this junction? Are we ap appeal to remove every taint of partition politics from it? Assume the chairmanship of the committee as the president and a 
appoint Professor Tyro Jaga as my deputy or co-chair. And uh, as Dr. Gaduji, we say thank you, just remove yourself. So that any taint of politics in this environment will be erased completely. This is not about politics. This is about opportunity. This is about our nation. So, why I may be upset, Jagar will preside and continue to promote. We've solved the problem. We've identified the model for livestock management. It is done in other countries, in other climes, successfully promoted. It created great economy and empowerment for ordinary people. Traditional livestock system must be reformed to add significant and sustainable value to Nigerian socioeconomic growth and development. With all measures that is available to us, I don't want to turn this environment into another talk opportunity. I just want to at least inaugurate this committee to ensure that I'm ready, I assure you, and the Nigerian public that we need to create this economy, seize this opportunity, be it ranches you recommend and promote, I will work with it. And uh, luckily we have information and technology at present too. Hard of cows can be identified with chips and be tracked these days. The modern technology is available to us. We are ready to work. As I said from the beginning, with you, all of you, the solution is here. And we must run with it. The governors are hereby represented. Well, any law that might inhibit the promotion and the actualization of our objective, the Attorney General is here. Please give it a priority. And budget and economy planning is there. Find a budget head for it to grow. And finance is here as well to work hard for the money. <coughs> when you have great opportunity as this, why should Nigeria continue conflict? of the caliber of people that is here. This presents a unique opportunity also to delineate and establish a separate ministry called the Ministry of Livestock Development. <laughs> we developed Give people opportunity to excel. Our vet doctors. A 
can give us the necessary protection and opportunity to rear among breed, crossbreeding and and stop the wanton killing even animal feeds is a huge economy. Ladies and gentlemen, I hereby inaugurate the Renew Hope Livestock Reform Implementation Committee in Nigeria. <laughs> it is now in your hands. We are ready to work for the success of this program and the first success of the entire nation. So we will leave a Nigerian flag without stain to our children. Thank you very much.